There's a lot of colors I don't know where to go See a lot of colors Only feeling blue There's a lot of colors Lost within a haze Don't rely on others To get you through the maze The dreams are not the same for me Standing by the shore Why you're on the open sea Cannot take this anymore Welcome back to another video and welcome back to the woodland I'm back out and today it is a little bit moist. Yeah, it's chucking it down. I don't know whether you can hear it or not, probably, maybe, I don't know. So tonight I've got with me the one tigress, two man Cosmito tent or Cosmito tent, however you want to pronounce it. If you're interested in one of these tents, I shall stick a link to the one tigress website down in the description below. So you can go buy one of these down below if you want so yeah that's what we've got and that's what I'm gonna set up right now there it is the one Tigress Cosmito tent all set up the rain's slowly easing off we've also got as a little bit of a porch way a bit of extra rain protection I've got up a uh, British Army poncho just like that, wicked. Steve, uh, AKA Scoutman Steve on YouTube, gave me this uh, poncho when he come down for a trip. So thanks for that, Steve. I'll stick his uh, channel link in the description below if you wanna go check him out. But yeah, there she is. She is all set up. Absolutely hammered it down earlier and the tent is absolutely bone dry inside So good tent for the money and There's Alan Alun <laughs> He's He was set up, but then he's decided to have a change of plan. Yes, he wanted a change. Change of plan. So. Seeing the weather's a bit rubbish. Alan's gone full British military on this trip. So. Well, I did a, I did a poll on Facebook and so on, and it's what, what people wanted to see. So, I thought I'd drag all the British stuff out. And yeah, well, why not? Do one. I think um, the other thing that was popular, people wanted to see a camp using Mr. Poncho as a shelter, which yeah. we'll do at some point. Um, and also using my German kit at some point, I'll do a German sort of style camp, but uh, that'll be in the future at some point. Fair enough. Don't get drowned on this one, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully no more rain. But yeah, I'll stick Alan's link in the description below if you want to go check his video out on this trip. Time for a brew, I think. Just gonna get some 
dry kindling to start our fire when we have it. As it's been raining today, this stuff on these pine trees seem to be the driest stuff laying around. So we'll gather some of this up. Okay, time is getting on and I'm getting hungry. So, I've just got something simple tonight, a Wayfarer meal. Fart juice, as I call it, because it really makes me fart. And this one is uh, beef goulash. Mmm! Yes. Diced beef and vegetables in a light, lightly spiced gravy. Okay. So yeah, we're going to try that. I'm sure it'll be fine. Maybe. Probably not. Don't know, never had it. Going to try it. Alright, water's warming up now. So, let's just uh, shove it in there. And then I shall use that water afterwards to... Uh, Make a cup of coffee. There we go. Right, so I think oh, it's hot. This is done. Right. Hot. Very, very hot. Right, let's open this up and see what. This is like. Okay. Oh, God. Ooh, steaming up, sorry. There we go. Oh. It looks like vomit. I'm not even joking. Right. Yeah, it looks like vomit. So there it is. Oh, it actually looks like puke. Oh, God. Oh. Let's try a bit. Well, it certainly don't taste like puke. It's all right. I'd eat it again. I'm gonna make myself a coffee, eat this, and get back to you. How meatball. is it? Meatball, the meatballs and pasta. The, I've just, um, you know, done a bit of filming, and when you first open the pack, mm. the smell doesn't smell nasty, but it doesn't really smell like anything really but the taste is really good yeah which is all that matters isn't it does yours look like vomit like mine does no i'll show your camera yeah mm -hmm. looks a luminous orange mm. <laughs> yeah well that's what Because you're going to eat that and you're probably not going to shit for two days. <laughs> <laughs> I 
pretty sure they put something in it to stop your shit in, in the military rations. Well, that's why you always wash it down with beer. The two balance each other out, you see, and you just end up normal. Yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> Well, we've both been fed, and now it's, to be fair, we've all, we already had a drink, didn't we, when we got here? Yeah. As soon as we got here, pretty much. Um, tonight, I've got Captain Morgan rum and cola. Mmm. Mm. Yeah, and I've got Hobgoblin Ruby, which, Hobgoblin. which is one, one of my favourites, but I haven't had it for quite a long time, so I'm quite, quite enjoying this, so uh, mm. yeah, cheers. Cheers, everyone. And the rain has finally stopped. Yeah, for five minutes. Yeah. <laughs> it was raining when we come in earlier on this afternoon, and it's just rained almost constantly. Yeah, it rained as soon as I went to set, set my stuff up. Yeah. Never mind, we're there now. Yep. Got a fire going, got our drinks, we've had our dinner. Nothing else matters. No. Nope. And we're outside. Yay. Yay. Hmm. Oh, it's so nice to feel the heat off that fire. Yeah. I'm slowly drying yeah, it's, out. Yeah, it's drying the bottom of my trousers <laughs> a little bit. They, <laughs> they were wet at the bottom. Out. Yeah, it's good. It's good. We're two happy campers. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. the last bits. Oh, time for a nice hot chocolate, I think. Some of the coals out. Oh, lovely. Nice. Stand up. Minty hot chocolate. Minty, eh? Mmm. Oh, no expense spared. Mm -mm -mm. This is what you need before bedtime.
Good morning everyone. It's not raining this morning, which is good. Oh, just had breakfast. I think Alan slept all right. You sleep all right, Alan? Yeah, yeah, very well actually. Thank you. Yeah. I slept like a baby. Oh. Didn't get cold, nothing. Loads of room in that tent as well. Absolutely loads of room in the one tigress tent. It's like a palace for one person. Nice bit of kit. I'm enjoying using it. <clears throat> yeah, I'm gonna finish up my coffee, or as I call it, anti-murdery juicy juice. And I suppose start backing away. Well, that is it, all packed away. End of another trip. Me and Alan have tidied up, we had our fire. That's all uh, put to rest, covered up, and whatever. So yeah, the tent was great. Can't fault it, to be honest, apart from the fact it- uh... Like, share, and subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> Dickhead. <laughs> yeah, the, the tent from One Tigress is brilliant. Just, it, it is a pitch, the inner first. That's the only downside, so if it's raining like it was yesterday, it gets a little bit moist in there. But you can always rectify that by putting a tarp up above if you're taking an extra tarp or something just to work under. But yeah, I'll stick the link in the description below. Go check them out. They've got plenty of products. But yeah, thanks for coming, Alan. Thank you for having me along. It's yep. always fun. Yeah, yeah, we had a giggle, didn't we? Yeah, we had a giggle. I'll put Alan's uh, link in the description below so you can go check out his video of this camp and other ones that he's done. But yeah, thanks for watching. See you in the next video. See you later.